and welcome back to my YouTube channel Pecan Rich. This is a channel where we cook the simplest meals with the simplest ingredients that you can find just outside your door. If you are new here, Karibu Sana, and I have missed each one of you. Nime wamis, kuwamis, 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 but here I am back with a bang. Yo. Yes, baby. So today, Tunataka kupika something very interesting. Uh, it's something that most of you requested. You know, I've been going through your comments from uh, the time we did our first video, and I came across a recipe that some of you had requested. And ladies and gentlemen, this is a delicacy that is found in the coast. Sana sana wa coast ndio wala pena sana kupika na kama muna vio jua mamangu wa metoka uko coasto. So I did all I could so that I can make this happen. Sawa sawa. So introducing to you Biazi Karai. What wengi, our juangi venye Biazi Karai yu tegenezwa. Viazi karai and bajiaz, those are two different things. Today we are going to make viazi karai and not bajiaz. Process and yes, you to me to make viazi karai, it's the same process that you use to make your bajiaz. The difference is this kiazi, we are not going to slice it like to, to sako sako ivika crepes. No, no, no. This one we are going to do it twice like this, like this, like this. So in a kwani. Kimoja kikubwa. Sinisawa? Yeah. So this is what we are going to need. Definitely we are going to need the viazis here. And we are going to need unga. Unga yako hapa. Alright. Ini unga. This is all purpose flour. All purpose flour. And we have turmeric here. We have garam masala. We have curry powder. And we have salt. Then on this other side. I'm going to show you how to prepare a sauce. A sauce that you can take with this particular uh, viazikarai. So, our next thing to do after usha toa nini? Usha diga. Kudiga ni kutawaru. Okay, after usha toa ngozi ya, uh, ya viazi, of course you wash your viazis. Then, let me show you how you slice these viazis. This is how we are going to slice this warus into twos like that. But I think you can do it into four four times depending on the new nataka. But me, this is how I'm going to do it. I'll slice them into half each. It really doesn't matter how big the waru is or how small it is. But you can do that. You kiwa mzima ivo but haita shikapua. Ivo. So no na. We've sliced into two like this. So follow the procedure nicely and you'll get a good uh, good outcome. So I had my uh, water boiling there. So kitun tafanya nektai kachumbi kwa majiangu. Then it's 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 for it to taste. So then tweke viazi. We are boiling our viazis. Keep that in mind. To na boil my viazi. Like this. Ne waru. This waru. This what we are boiling. Sour. We are boiling our viazis. To ne to waru. To waru to ne ne. To waru to ni ni. To ade to ha ha to waru. Let me test. Yeah, that's enough salt. So we wait for our viazis to boil. Sour and soft and this is a tena sana. Does this is mash. Aya. Come, 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 come. I show you. As we wait for our viazis to get ready, I want us to mix this particular paste. So this is all purpose flour. As I had told you, I'm going to put in my turmeric. Turmeric is to change the color of the flour. Kuna watu weka turmeric, na kuna watu weka food color. So, acha tuweke turmeric for now. But you can put food color if you want it to shika vizuri. I can add more in case ni one. Woo! masala. 
Okay, you Meisha. Let's do curry powder. This is for tasting curry powder like that. Then we're going to put salt in our flour like that. Then and so I'm going to put it in the flour. Then paprika. I've got some paprika, paprika like that. Sour. Then mix your flour nicely like this kashimo hapo katikati karima then unaanza ku mix paste yako sawa we are doing a very nice paste so thick na si light Sour. It's like you're making pancakes. The paste should look like that, like you're making pancakes. I think our paste is ready. Just make sure it's thick. Na haina makomboro. Makomboro ni niza maunga unga. Make sure it me mix yote pamoja. All of it. Mix it nicely. And also note you can do away with the spices. You really, really don't have to use the spices. You can do away with them if you don't want them. Sour. You see how how it looks? See how it looks? Like that. So our paste is ready for the next process. To make a candle. I had told you I'm going to uh, to show you how to make uh, the sauce that you're going to use with our Yazuka rice. Natengeneza sauce ya ukwaju. Ukwaju inaitwa si okay guys sikumbuki. Okay. Ukwaju it has a name. Ndio hiyo jina ndio hiyo hapo kwa screen. Jina ndio hiyo ya ya ukwaju in English. I've forgotten. So this is what you are going to make. Mm. Baka mate meja kwa mdomo. This is what we are going to use. This is what we are going to use to make our sauce for for our Jazikarai, man. Mate imeja kwa mdomo. I'm so serious. Cheese. Actually, wacha tuni, wacha tuni ya sekute mamate tu, wacha tuni toe kamoza ni mumunye. Satisfaction. Aya. So this is what you are going to use. You'll need the ukwaju. Then, I'm going to merge like that. I'm going to soak kiasi. Wait for it to soak kiasi. Then, here, I'm going to make great saumu and the onion, the normal onion. So, I'm going to make great. Then, Nika soak kwa vinegar. The reason why I soaked it kwa vinegar is simply because I hate onion tastes and all. So I decided to, or rather, I just soak it in vinegar. Haya, when I soak hivo, I have a candle. Alafu, here I have choma sauce. Or you can use any any ketchup that you have. No, you can use any tomato sauce that you have. Sour. Or any sauce that you have, sauce of your choice. So me, me decide to to me here. So it has chili, sour. So we check. Oh, and we have um our nini. The natural nini is rosemary. Is it rosy kata kata to apa to like a I show you how we're going to. Show how we're going to sort it out. La puta skianga. His own nails, Caesar Kupika. Yo, a tea that is not hygienic. 
Yo, what is doing Nini? See, the best thing is I'm cooking for me, myself, and the family. Then I'm going to insert them here. Koyo sauce too. Like that. Sour. Then, guys, back to our ukwaju. This is what you're going to do. Try to I know. Hmm. Who has a sour, mm, sour buds like mine? Yani na skia tu. Na skia tu sour, sour buds. Na skia tu mati meja kwa mdomo. So this is your kwaju for you. It has a sour, a very nice, mm, ah, mm, very nice sour taste. This is your tu from them. From the from the ukwaju. What I'm going to do with this, I'm going to mix it inside here. So I'm going to mix it inside there like that. Then definitely you mix with the with the other network with the other Shoma sauce with the other sauce that was inside there. Then let me come. You remember our saumu? Here we are. Our saumu and vinegar and our kitungu, the red onion. I don't know why it's red. Onion and it's purple. We even gave it that name at red onion. You put it inside there. Then you mix well. Then you mix it very nicely. Then you mix it very nicely. So I don't want to meet to, to to waste this. Let me put a little water. Yeah. Then you coroga nicely like that. So you mix your sauce nicely. No, no. Step by step. So what I'm trying to do ni kutoa hizi kubwa kubwa. Za hizo makani kitungu kuna kenya kana kwa kama mebaki ako ni kona try kutoa kapa the big piece. Don't worry about the rosemary. The rosemary you can consume in a shida. Even the others you can. Just that you want some fine sauce. So, me understand kitu na fanya. I'm getting rid of the big pieces za vitungu zenye zilikuwa zimeingia ndani zimesha so finally we need okay not not a must but you can put some leaves to in my stock season remember all this time we are waiting for our roots to to get ready sawa Naza kadania kwa ile paste yetu yenye tulitengeneza ya unga if you want to We have our paste ready just like that. Sawa. Remember hatujamaliza bado viazi zetu bado but our paste so far this paste is ready. We set that aside. So, watu wangu, viazi zetu zilikuwa zishaiva. Here, here they are. So what we're going to do? Okay, zilikuwa mingi. Izo zingine zita. Is this is just for the video? Izo zingine ni za sapa. What what a kula? Izo zingine. So I'm just shooting this few for the sap for the nini for the video. So here we are. There's one thing you need to know. Viazi karai usi usi zipike ati zinini zive zinini zi kimeke. Okay, zive sana. That is. Make sure you do it nicely. No, no. Mafuta yako iko iko kwa jiko na get ready. So, so you coat your viazi nicely. Coat viazi zako poa. Make sure hatutaki zikimane. Sawa. 
you don't want the viazis to kimanata fadhali so you have to coat them nicely remember i'm telling you on the other side mafta yako ndio ina oops then i get ready so na sisi hapa tuna coat viazi vizuri to check on our mafta ready <laughs> you take your waru then inside like that kamoja kamoja hivyo waru yako moja moja waru yako moja moja We continue with the process again. with the process again like that same same So guys, I think our viazis are ready just like that. So guys, it's time to test our viazi karais. This is sosieto. So we can don't afanya ni package. Mm. Tena mtaka kwa mtu. Mm. hiyo mani. Mm. Nimesikia kwa kichwa toa toa toa. <laughs> mm. This is heaven. You have no idea how amazing this is. Especially this sauce, eh? Hizo ni tamu watu wangu chini wa show tena. Hizo ni tamu by the way si jokes. Si jokes. It's no joke man. No kidding. Ah. No kidding. No kidding. This sauce is heavenly. Mm. It takes me back to coast me back to Mombasa Palevo, Mamangina Street hapo. It's just amazing. 
it's so 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 nice so guys that's all about it today if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe here 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 and hit the notification bell so that every time I post a new video you'll be notified on the same so let's go do our viazi karai